Hi, I'm Chris Bryce with SuperService.com. I'm going to talk to you about how to fix a corrupt system with Windows XP operating system. Now, if you've got the Windows XP operating system and you've got something corrupt, whether it be a corrupt file or something that's keeping you from loading Windows properly, the easiest way to fix this problem is to insert your Windows XP installation CD or recovery disk before you boot your computer. Once you insert the CD and then start up, it's going to give you the option of booting from the CD and it's going to offer you recovery options. You can either run the recovery console or you can do a repair Windows installation. Now, the repair Windows installation will fix any corrupt files on your system. The key to keep in mind here though is if you've had any updates or service pack updates, these recovery options will revert back to older versions of those files sometimes so that when you actually fix the corrupted files, you may end up having to re-update things once you go into Windows XP after recovery. That's one thing to keep in mind. Also, in the recovery field where it's command prompt based, and you can type in commands, you can selectively choose files to copy over using a DOS-based command prompt. This is mainly for advanced users, so I would try the reinstallation mode first, where you actually fix the problems and repair the problems rather than doing a clean reinstall of Windows. That's the easiest way to fix a corrupt system that is running the Windows XP operating system.